I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Hi everyone. Welcome to my tea talk. <laughs> Do you get it? Mum. I'm not listening. I'm actually thinking I'm gonna do a baking video. Let's get right into the video. You can defo tell I'm British because I make a mean. I was very, I was very proud of myself last video. I did not say like w as near to many times as I did in my first video. So I'm gonna set a challenge for myself and every video is gonna get less and less likes. Well, not hopefully not likes, but likes if you know what I mean. So I don't know what, I don't know what um, thingy to choose. So I could go really easy because my baking skills are very limited, but I could, is that seven minutes already? <laughs> God, God damn. Let me go to the hard section. 15 minutes later. Is there a hard section? A few hours later. So we are 10 minutes into the um we are 10 minutes into the video and I have chosen chocolate chip cookies. And you wonder why I don't tell them from TikTok. Also just a quick intervention. Who likes my new coat? Everyone says it's a um swampy green colour, but I think it's brown. Hate me if I'm colour blind, but this is defo brown. It's not swamp green, which is what I've been receiving today. But I just love it. So I just thought I'd show you guys because I think it's one of the nicest jackets ever. And it's got so much fur inside. It's from Pull and Bear if anyone wanted to get it. I got the size extra small because I'm five foot four. So things that are really large on me as in these long jackets and trench coats everyone gets, yeah, could never be me because I, uh, it would absolutely swamp me. Cobus! Come! Oh, you're such a big boy. You're such a big boy. the chocolate chips and I was walking in the shop for a good like 20 minutes so I didn't want to walk in anyone longer so I just got chocolate buttons as a substitute which I personally think is better than the chocolate chips that everyone wears sells and also I found out I didn't have I didn't have flour either so I got that and do you know what muscovado sugar um honestly this is probably why I don't find muscovado sugar because look at it does it really look like sugar no. Okay, heat the oven to 190 degrees fan. Okay. Okay. So I don't actually know how to work my oven, but I'm pretty sure that is 170. And I'm not stupid because my oven is actually really com I'm not stupid because that sounds like I'm really dumb, but my oven is actually very hard to work your way around i've got a lot of this is my baking tray which i'm using i'm not gonna line them why does that keep happening shh, shh. i'm just gonna butter them up i'm gonna butter the babies up lining is just too much effort so i'm just gonna i'm just gonna get a slob of butter and whack it on the tray and see what happens I'm pretty sure that's like how you're supposed to do it, so. Lovely. <coughs> God, I've literally got the coronavirus. Please, God, help me. Save my family, honestly. Also, I'm, trying, I'm baking while looking after the dog. And the thing is, I don't think that's very hygienic because obviously every time I touch Covis, even though... He's a puppy, he's actually a really dirty boy. 
Like, I've caught him on many occasions eating his own poo. Which is bad boy movements. You don't eat your own poo. But, um, yeah. So I'm not, I'm gonna try every time I touch, well, I'm, I am going to, every time I touch Clovis, I am going to wash my hands. No one wants to eat poo cookies. How much this makes? How do you know how much it makes? Oh my God, it makes 30 cookies. Right, I'm gonna half all of this. So 150. Quick maths, 150 grams is 150, 70. 75, 75, yeah. I'm not gonna do butter first actually because it like kind of actually yes, I am. I lie. I lied to you all. Don't believe me. I'm a true liar. So my hair kind of just smells like cookie dye. I don't know if that, that's a thing that happens when you cook cookies, but when I tell you my hair smells like cookie dough, it smells like cookie dough. 80 grams of light muscovado sugar and 80 grams granulated sugar into a bowl and beat until creamy. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of stab it. Love it. Call me Gordon Ramsay because you can't beat these shit, guys. Come on, Muscovado, baby. Get out of your package. Oh, that was a little bit too much, but we, we can work with it. 235. Oh, God, why are we at like 400? If you're watching this and you want to make good cookies, mm, I don't know what to tell you. We are so not supposed to be at 300 right now. Does anyone else love it when you've got like a cold and your voice kind of goes like this? Like, I feel like I'm supposed to be in a movie. The main character in the movie. I'm going to bring you over here. So I've got my bowl here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it into this whisking thing because it just makes my life so much easier if I put it in here. Oh well. Go on. Go on, son. Get in there. Go on. Go on, mate. Get in there. Go on, son. Would you guys say that's light and creamy? I would, so we're gonna move on to the next step. I'm gonna add one large egg. Oops, gone. I got so much shed in that. So I have added my flour, my bicarbonate of soda, and whatever the hell, salt, I haven't added salt, oh well. Yes, well. If you guys say that licking the mixture isn't the best part of baking, you're lying to yourself. That, that looks like cookie. Just one big loop of cookie. So here are the cookies. They're looking a bit tragic. This one is a little bit deformed, but oh well, it probably tastes good, which is all that matters. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight of them. And they're all going to taste beautiful, so I'm going to put them in the oven now at 170 degrees and we will see how these babies turn out. But they're looking quite good, I think, personally, because every time I make cookies, it just somehow turns out wrong. <laughs> Me and my cookers are going to do a thumbnail. Bruh. Oh god, why? Oh! 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 How is it raw? I don't understand. Hmm. Tastes nice though. You guys want to see the second attempt? So half of it has fallen out actually into the microwave. And I don't know what this is. I just, I'm a bit like, <laughs> who would want to eat that? Somehow it's dry. That is like pure sugar. Well, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. It means a lot to me. And I'll see you next Wednesday. So I hope everyone has a good day. Bye, everyone.